wonderful place we are. We are in the hills of Byron Bay. At the back, it's a little, little old town called Main Arm, and it's beautiful, and it's close to home, and that's why we chose to do it here. This time around, we thought we wanted to be comfortable and just be, be at home to be inspired, because right now, if we did do it over there, we'd be in New Jersey. Um, it's coming into winter, I'd be freezing cold. We'd be stuck inside all day and it is hard to be inspired when you're in those kind of conditions. We're all sleeping in our own beds at night and, uh, and I, I guess that's why we chose it. We, and we wanted to record, you know, somewhere that wasn't in the middle of winter, somewhere. It's, it's beautiful and summer weather here and it's good inspiration for the record. Being at home while recording that really brings brings us into the music and shows shows everyone what we're all about. As for Will, we we did the Equinox EP, like the split with North Lane with him recently, and um, we just loved the way he worked and how he worked with us creating things, and we wanted to do it again. So that's why he's here with us now. He's just a, a great guy to work with. <laughs> very easy and he knows what he's doing so we also at the moment we're doing something different and we're currently tracking um, guitars lead guitars while uh, vocals are also being tracked in another room um, which is very different for what we've done before because usually you'll have all five people sitting in the room um, while you're either tracking vocals or guitars and everyone's just sitting there watching you sort of do that one thing and in a way it's good because everyone's listening out but sometimes it gets a bit much so it's nice to have everyone kind of separated doing their own things and you have a bit more time to, to try different stuff you know as pressured um, and rushed to get it done so that's really nice. In Heart's Wake is very much and always has been Divination, Earthwalker, Skydancer, so those themes are going to continue to come forward in this record. Uh, Ark will, will touch on many topics that have been touched on before, but in a new light, in a new way. And we want to put a spotlight on the water because the water is literally 92% of our blood is water. We are water. We are waterborne. And it is the most fundamental and most critical element to our existence. We need all four, but it is our lifeblood. So uh, we want to really spotlight that and bring an awareness to the water. But I think the, the biggest thing that's changed since our last recording is just, we've done a lot of touring and we've done a lot of touring with bands that we really look up to and we've learnt a lot off. And I think we've matured a lot since the last time we recorded and I think we know what we want to create this time. Whereas before we were still finding what we wanted in Hearts Wake to be, but this time we really knew what we wanted to create and we really weren't scared of doing anything to, to do that. It's fun to work with a band that has like a really clear vision of what they want to do and I hope that what I do, you know, I can sort of bring my own kind of take on it and kind of highlight what's unique about the band. So, you know, I feel like we are accomplishing that and I'm really excited to uh, wrap it all up. You know, you see a lot of bands releasing things and everyone just critiques it and the, every little, you know, thing someone's got a problem with, but it'd be cool if people would just listen to it for what it is, a bunch of guys that, you know, love chilling and relaxing, but we also enjoy writing music. Well, I guess what I want people to take away from this album is just whatever they think it to be. I mean, I mean, this can be whatever you want. I mean, we, we wrote these songs for ourselves and I guess, 
you know, whatever you can, whatever positivity you can drag from what we've done I, is, is a great thing and, and we're happy with that. So if you enjoy this album, well, that's amazing. Thank you. <laughs> I'd love for people to listen to the album from start to finish, absorb the themes and what, you know, the, the different moods that we want to express and to just enjoy it. It's a piece of music, it's a piece of art that we have poured our lives into the last two years of our lives and are still pouring everything into it now as we are tracking it. So just to enjoy it. <laughs>